Hello everybody. I thought I'd do an update from the workshop. Um, so yesterday I posted about how I was doing a really nice uh, black strat, the David Gilmore style guitar, inspired by that guitar, um, my own kind of like relic take on it. Uh, it went really well. Um, I worked out that the pots were uh, just worn out, so I replaced them with brand new ones. Um, which is kind of what you want in a new guitar, but I like to upcycle and stuff like that. So if I have good bits laying around, I'll try and use them. Um, so yeah, it got sent off this morning, a bit of a mad rush to finish the um, setup, but um, I, I've got a really tight schedule at the moment, so I ha had to get it out of the door. Um, and at the moment I'm working on this really nice, well, it now it's really nice. When it came to me, it was a bit sad. Um, it's all parts licensed fender neck um, it's going on a grey coloured strat here which um, is kind of like a, a swampy green and that's going to be a really tasty relic with uh, sunburst coming through um, but when, when it arrived to me the edges were just like razors they will cut your hands playing up and down, which shouldn't really happen for a £200 neck, um, but they, that does happen all the time. Uh, so yeah, that's what I'm doing today. I'm focusing on a bunch of Relic Fender guitars that I've been commissioned to sort out, such as this quite dusty but still incredible purple sparkle sunburst Relic that's sort of halfway through. Um, this gold AVRA nitro finish and at least one other shall we say um, yeah at least one other so very busy here and hope you're safe out there and um, enjoying the sunshine in the crisis and not feeling the crisis at all because who wants to feel a, a crisis have a great day